Accountability is the backbone of a successful organization. It's about making sure that everyone is committed to their roles, responsibility and goals, and therefore driving the team forward with purpose and clarity. Hi everyone, my name is Isabel New and I'm a tech and product leader based in Sydney, Australia. Today I share with you how you can go about building an accountable organization as a senior leader. Being accountable for a large group of people as a senior leader is different from being a frontline manager, especially in large organizations. A senior leader is not a frontline manager who is responsible for day-to-day operations of the team, but they are accountable for ensuring that their teams are heading in the right direction and are delivering business results over a period of time. The goal is to foster a culture of accountability, and here is how you can go about doing so. There are seven steps to a greater accountability, and I will be diving deeper into each of them today. Firstly, define clear rule and expectation. The foundation of accountability is clarity. As senior leaders, we must clearly define roles, responsibility, and expectation for each team and their ownership area. This includes setting specific measurable, achievable, relevant and time-bound goals, known as SMART goals. When expectations are clear, team members understand their responsibilities and know what success looks like. And when they know what success looks like, they can use their creative thinking and problem-solving abilities to achieve that success. This clarity reduces ambiguity and lays the groundwork for accountability. Secondly, lead with transparency. Transparency is key to cultivating trust and accountability. Share information openly and encourage your team to do the same. When decisions are made, explain the rationale behind them. This openness helps to create an environment where team members feel informed and value. Transparency fosters a culture where accountability is not seen as a burden, but as a shared commitment to success. Thirdly, encourage ownership. Empower your team by encouraging them to take ownership of their tasks and projects after clearly defining what success looks like for them. When individuals feel a sense of ownership, they are more likely to hold themselves accountable. Encourage initiative and autonomy, allowing team members to make decisions and learn from their experiences. This empowerment not only boosts accountability, but also enhances engagement and motivation. And don't be afraid for them to make mistakes because this is how they will learn and grow as individuals. The next step is to establish regular check-ins. Regular check-in and progress reviews are vital for maintaining accountability. Schedule consistent meetings where team members can discuss their progress, challenges, and any support that they might need from you. These check-ins provide an opportunity to offer feedback, celebrate achievements, and address any issues early on. They also help reinforce the importance of accountability in meeting team objectives. The next one is to provide constructive feedback. Constructive feedback can be given at any point in time and you don't necessarily wait for the check-in time to provide constructive feedback. Feedback is a powerful tool for accountability. Offer constructive feedback regularly, as I said earlier, and focusing on behaviors and outcomes rather than personal characteristics or attributes. Be specific and objective and highlight area of improvements while recognizing successes. Constructive feedback help individuals understand their impact on the team goals and motivate them to improve and stay accountable. Acknowledging and rewarding accountability can reinforce its importance within your team. Celebrate those who consistently meet their commitments and contribute positively to the team's success. Recognition can be a public or private one, but it should always be sincere and specific. Rewards don't have to be Grand gestures, sometimes a simple acknowledgement can go a long way in encouraging continued accountability. And last but not least, address accountability issues promptly. 
have open conversation with team members who are struggling to meet expectations, understand the reasons behind their challenges, and work together to find solutions. By addressing issues early, you prevent small problems from escalating and demonstrate that accountability is a priority. Accountability is not just about holding other people responsible. It's also about creating a shared commitment to excellence. When every team member feels accountable, they contribute to a collective success that is greater than the sum of its parts. As senior leaders, our role is to guide, to support and to inspire our teams to achieve great outcomes once success is defined and it can be measured. By fostering accountability, we empower our teams to work collectively, overcome challenges and achieve remarkable results.